Good morning. Welcome back to the Chronicles of the Dovahkiin Desdenova. Last episode, our protagonist came across this random mine on her way to Rorikstad. Told she had, quote, better not go in because of the draugr therein, Desdenova immediately entered the mine and now has to drop down this hole to clear out the remaining undead. There we go. Now we just kick ass. What else we got down here? I'm just gonna stand there. That was pretty efficient execution. It's also pretty crappy loot. But I really am not expecting anything from these droggers. Just kinda hoping they would have like a soul gem or something. Sometimes they, they do. Save it here. Uh, yeah, that's <laughs> a little too obvious. Okay, we'll take that. Question is, is it this one? Or is it this one? Or is it both of them? Yeah, that. Not quite sure. That was a trap of some sort. Alright, there's a lot of you in here. Don't fuck around. Wow, there are a lot of them in here. really like to use um, my lightning rune because there's a whole shitload of them. It's kind of bunched up together. I can't. Bet you I can now though. Are you kidding me? I re oh, there's got... If there's a mod that fixes that lightning rune spell, email it to me. Now I have no magicka. That really sucks, actually. She's almost dead. I take no chances. Oh. Are you a priest? 
Ah, uh, right now I'm more pissed off <laughs> than a priest. of flames I'm not quite sure how that got favorited put there Behind you. Uh, you know the deal. I am sworn to carry your burdens. I still hear combat music. I'm wondering if one of them is still alive. I'm also wondering what I'm carrying that's weighing me down so much. All oh, two staffs of steel war axe? Why do I need to steal War Axe? Oh, there's... Alright, how do I... Alright, right there. Dead. Alright, that was kind of freaky, so what we're going to do is we're going to save the game right here. Garlic. Alright, one time... I actually drowned under here because Lydia blocked <laughs> the exit. So what we're going to do is not make sure I miss any burial urns. Still we're going to have her wait here. As you wish, my thing. Well, I go for a swim. That there, I knew there was a chest down here. Ruby, huh? Take that. We heading out? We are. As you will, my thing. I will protect you with my life. Now we'll see about that. Trapped it does nothing. Come on, Lydia. You're stuck on that candle. Over here. Come on. Did I miss something? I think I did. Yeah, alright. Chest. 
Yeah, because my night would have been incomplete if I did not acquire those leather boots. Somewhere along the line, we will get a good chest, though. We're almost due for one. There's definitely something nasty in this room. Courage you up. I got stuck on that. I was hoping as they blow all my magic just to stay alive. All right. Wow. You know what? Let's use our elemental fury here. This guy's got a lot of hit points. Let's make sure you don't die. Let's make sure I don't die. <laughs> uh, we'll just finish him the old fashioned way, I think, here. Little tactics, little preparation, and that's not very exciting. Oh, what was that? Ruby, take that. Are there any other hard to see gems on this table? No. That looks like something, but it's not. Lydia, what are you going to take? <laughs> the leather boots. Don't need that dwarven sword. Wow, I am just hauling around a lot of crap. Well, we don't need that basket. Goat hide? I don't remember taking that. Basket. <laughs> Where's that basket? Get out of here. Curtains. All right, back to the looting chests. Pretty. She's already got steel plate boots. Alright, what level am I? 18. And she's still in steel armor. <laughs> the chests have not been kind. Alright, I guess I got all the mining out of here. Although, what's up here? Fire heart. It's pretty good value, although it's only a steel so iron sword. We'll take it. All right, eventually, I will come across a chest in which I am legitimately excited about. But we cleared the sinkhole. We did our good deed for the day, so... Let's get back on the road to Rorikstead.
Find yourself with that fire. Don't burn anything down now. I clear the mine. You did? We were waiting for the Yarl to send an entire regiment to clear that mine. Now we can get back to work. Thank you. Ah, 750 gold? Alright, I'll take that. Mm -hmm. I won't sell you my moon store. I might need that. Alright, Rourke's dead. Right up this road. Or path, I guess it's more accurately. Save it. Now, what did that place was called? I'm not. Sh I'm sure I did it at some point. Solyun's sinkhole. All right. Learn something new about the Skyrim landscape every playthrough. All right. So we got a tower over there and a crypt over here. I think I had my fill of crypts for today. Let's try something different. I bet you these are forsworn. Who the hell else would live in this godforsaken place? Ah! Sounded like a wolf. <laughs> Alright, we're ready to rock and roll here. Yep, they're already pissed off. That's all right. Yeah, Forsworn for sure. Oh, and they're already pissed off. Whoops, sorry about that. Yeah, you're really tough with those two weapons, huh? Alright, we want to force Sworn on our side. It never should have come here! Oh, we got a hag raven up here? We got two hag ravens. Okay, for some reason, I'm having trouble aiming this lightning spell. We got a perk that allows us faster attack speed. Let's use it. I think I missed. What else is new with that spell? Oh, God. Uh, we're going to kill you with our fury power. Oh, I actually did hit that. Where are you going? There's still another one up there, isn't there? Well, let's loot these four sworn and then go up there and kill them on our leisure. I'm gonna run out of carrying capacity again. All right, let's just go kill them. Wow. Definitely gonna need some elemental resistance sooner rather than later. Oh, 
shit, shit. Ah. Uh, I'm not gonna make it. You know what? I haven't used this spell yet. Problem is, I gotta get the fuck back up there. Hang on, Lydia. Hang on. Wow, there's a lot of shit over there. Uh, not while I'm here. Actually, we better elemental fury. I got no magic left. Man, die already! Okay, I want your soul. Got it. There's another one up there. Let's see if I can uh, disease her. What that disease spell does is it um it does da a, a little damage over time, but if some if the victim casts a spell, it spreads on to another um, target. So it's pretty good to use, and um, you're facing a bunch of spellcasters like Hag Ravens or Forsworn or bunched together. If you can get one, the idea is it jumps to another, and jumps to another. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but it's slow damage over a pretty long time uh, so potentially you can just deal you can get a lot of them infected in a very with just one casting against obviously like undead or even just melee fighters it's really not that useful because it either doesn't hurt them or it doesn't spread but that sounds like another hag raven up here <laughs> Probably should have soul trapped her. I think I need another one. Yeah. Oh, oh well. <laughs> it's alright. There's plenty of other things we're gonna come across. Is there a reason why I can't take that? King. What do you need? Read that. Okay, got it. Anything else? All right, we got some pizza being delivered here, so we're going to pause this. All right, so if I remember rightly, White Run is just what a mud crab here. Okay, well, let's, uh, 
Let's get some destruction practice. Actually, do I need some soul gems? Nah, they're petty. We'll just be zapping them. And let's use our little rune here. I didn't finish them off. That's right. Alright, as I was saying, White Run should just be over, or White Run, Rourke's Dead should be just over this little cliff. We got some Saber Cats over there I gotta be careful of. Oh, it's not so much I'm afraid of them, I just don't want them ambushing me while I'm not looking. Especially since I'm going to be doing a little bit of mining. So, let's get a little extra armor, just in case they... <laughs> decided to go after me instead of those elk. And, well, I don't see them, but I thought there was... Okay, yeah. It's another uh, mine here. If you're wondering why <laughs> I'm scouring the plains of Whiterun looking for every single iron vein... Those of you who have the Hearthfire DLC will know why. It takes a lot of iron ingots to build a house. And that just... That's not even including all the smithing that I want to do. So yeah, if you got Hearthfire, you kind of have to mine every single iron uh, vein you come across. It's like we got a little house in the middle of nowhere here. Not sure. This is, uh, no, this is not part of Orkstead. We have a lot of skeevers there, though. This is time for a lightning ruin if there's a whole bunch of them. Alright, get them all in one spot. There we go. Oh shit, there's a lot of skeevers! Alright, just more opportunities to practice the uh, destruction skill here. And we can always take them out the old fashioned way. That's a shot. Maybe getting my aim back a little bit. <laughs> Alright, I don't know where Lydia is, but we're going to check out this, um, this little house or hut. Lund's hut. I suppose he's hostile. Well, there were a lot of skeevers out here. I'm not going to take any chances. And there's nothing else. All right, let's just get in there. There's a lot of skeevers in here! I guess that's not surprising. Oh, Lund, you got a mess here. But I think that's the least of your problems. Yeah. Well, I didn't think you'd have anything exciting. And we'll take that pelt. Poison. Won't use it. Sell a nice price. Honey brew mead. Do got to applaud your taste. Not sure I want to cook anything from here. Yeah, definitely not. And what do we have up here? The Shroud of the Gray Fox. I don't know what it is, but it certainly is expensive. I've got your back. I think that's Lunds. Well, I know he wasn't the Gray Fox. I suppose he could be a nephew. Let's see what it does. If we can find it. Oh, there it is. Alright. Yeah, I kind of figured it would be worn by him. It looks a little shabby, to be honest with you. But I suppose that from the front doesn't look too bad. I'm guessing this shroud is not about the looks or the aesthetic. It's about um, the performance. I'm guessing it will help us be a better sneak. A lot better. All right. Desanova won't be wearing this because she's not a sneaking type character. It wouldn't do her any good. And plus... I'm not sure I like the overall look of it, 
So we'll save that in case there will be a point in this game where we do have to do some stealth. Um, it'll help us out very much since our sneak skill is for crap, basically. So we're going to keep that. We won't sell it. We'll, <laughs> in our non-existent house, we'll store it. I'm right behind you. All right, so let's get to Rorkstead and mend whatever bridges need mending. But it looks like eh, wolves. Let's start practicing my aim and the destruction skill. There we go. There's a shot. There we go. Getting the hang of it again. Getting the hang of the game. Oh, well, as soon as I say that. <laughs> I, yeah, I'm going to loot that. Don't ask me why I <laughs> was waiting on that. I had other thoughts in my mind. Like, where should I put this attribute? I'm going to need stamina because there have been times I've power attacked and ran out of it, needed it, but I'm going to hold off on that for one more level. I'd really like the health to be above the Magicka. Because you can have all the stamina in the world if you have no hit points, it doesn't do you any good. Whereas you can survive without stamina. It's just annoying. So for now, we choose life over... Or excuse me, we choose annoyance over death. Alright, we don't think we won't be carrying a weapon around, walking around Warwick's dead, so we'll sheathe that. And let's try to find out exactly uh what we did here. I've a lot of respect for the restoration school. Skyrim could use more healers. Okay. That's cool. 